I've run a B&B for the last 35 years and Kate has joined me this is the past two years. Two years. Yeah, full time. Kate's, um, she trained as a singer. The odd times now she might burst into song for the guests and they love it. Yeah, if my mum traps me inside in the conservatory and she says, Kate will sing you a song now. <laughs> so I'm serving plates. Yeah. You know, and we take care of people. That's what we love to do. And I suppose the greatest privilege of all is we meet people when they're on holiday. Generally, that's when they're at their best. We have fun doing it. Lots of fun. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't have as much fun as we're having, but you know. We're very lucky in this house. The land that this house was built on was my grandfather's. And Kate's kids are the eighth generation of our family here. So with the help of God, it'll continue for many years to come. Most houses in Doolan would be a minimum of six generations. A lot for us is just taking the time to hang out with people as well and have the chat, share stories, you know, and not take ourselves too seriously. And We're only three minutes in the pub. I've walked it in two, <laughs> but it's taken me longer to come home, but it can be done in three. Three good minutes and you're there. So, I mean, we've people staying with us over 30 years. Now it's gotten to the extreme that they're coming on holiday with us. They've been in Scotland, Sicily, London, America with us. One uh, couple have spent three Christmases already with us. Mm. They love it, but they, it's not just here, it's the whole experience of doing it. You know, they've gotten to know the local people. They feel part of a community. 